Hi, this is Trip. Welcome to my channel. I hope you will subscribe to the channel and like the videos. Please share it with others. And by the way, there's a bell down there next to the subscribe button. I understand you should also ring that so you'll receive notifications of videos. Well, I saw a video one time that ASMR artists did where they were just organizing change. But it was really more trouble than I thought it would be as far as setting up lights and, and all that kind of thing. So, I want to organize all this change here into little stacks. Maybe like by denomination, of course, and maybe by what, maybe 10 in each step. I'll just kind of make it up as we go along here. I think I'll just start separating them by denomination. I guess the most, that's the most efficient way to do this. of uh, these pennies here all together. That's relatively easy. Maybe I should count them out now. Like one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Mm. That came out to ten. Really, by pure coincidence. Okay. How many fives I have here? Nickels. One, two, three, four. I have five nickels. I need five more. Two. Oops. Three. Four, five. Uh oh, yeah, that's right. No. One, two, three, four. Yeah, five. Oops. Seven. Eight, nine, ten. Actually, some of these. Oh, I didn't want ten. There's ten I put there now. Okay. That's fine. Five more now. One, five more nickels. Two, three, four, five nickels. Five, ten now. One, two. I guess then they've been out for a long time. They just don't look well, they don't look like the old nickels, do they? From many years ago. I got some dimes. Two, three, four, five, oops, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more, ten, okay. See how far I get. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, cinq, six. Un, deux, trois, quatre, un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, cinq, six, sept, sept, huit, 
Oh, I'm getting it all confused with Spanish. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and two more dimes. Nine, ten. I'm going to try it in German next. I'll have much better luck with that. Back to the pennies. Ein, zwei, drei, vier. Fünf, six, seven, eight, nine, same. No problem there. I can count to any numbers in, in German. That's easy for me. I could count to a million if I had to. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Try it in Spanish now. And do the nickels again. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. Right? Forgive my pronunciation. And yeah. So, put that behind the nickels over here. Hmm. Maybe some more dimes. What was this in French? Un, deux, trois, quatre, cent, six, sept. Oui. Neuf. <laughs> I can't remember. bug me now that I can't remember how to count to ten in, in French. I can do most of it, apparently. Not all of it. I'm going to order this a little bit better here. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cent, six. Ah, that is so embarrassing, and I apologize to all our French speakers out there. There probably aren't many. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Get rid of some of these nickels here now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. is just so discolored. I guess that's nine. I thought it would maybe round out pretty even, but I guess not. Two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hmm. Fancy bed. Nine. How about dimes again? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
again ten times. night now we have left his pennies One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten pennies here. Should be like one, two, four, six, eight, ten. When I was like a like fifteen or sixteen, I had a, I started a coin collection. I've been in the mid sixties, and you could still find a lot of of good stuff in circulation in the local bank where I had my my first little account. I remember I had. $99.99 when I started it off. But anyway, I also have that past book too. All the way back to like 58 or 59. So, the president of the bank was, he was a real old guy. And uh, he had been going through coins for years. Of course, he was probably like maybe 75 or or 80 even back in the mid 60s so he was able to collect coins all the way back to the 1800s when there were still there were still coins like that and valuable coins in circulation he had everything from pennies nickels dimes all kind of things up to gold even and I thought well I never have anything like that and sure enough I didn't I did spend some money on coin and collecting coins and finally though uh, I think it was in the it wasn't an exp it wasn't a valuable a hugely valuable collection and I won't go into the details it's probably not worth it but I had a, a nice collection and I took it to a coin store and sold it in in the mid or the, the maybe in the late 80s maybe 88 or 89 the reason I sold it was because I realized it was not super, not really exceptionally valuable. And I thought, well, what if people find out that I have a coin collection in my house? Maybe somebody will break in and, and steal it and kill me or something. That was the end of the coin collection. So we come up here with one, two, three, three stacks of nickels of ten each. And we have one with only nine. I really thought it was going to come out exact. I have one, two, three, four, five stacks of dimes. It's uh, I got uh, fifty of those. And one, two, three, four, five, five stacks of pennies. So I've got twenty-five cents of pennies here. I got about two, three, four, five dollars in dimes. And I guess these nickels are really 19, so I only have 95 cents of nickels. I don't see any more around. I guess that was it. So I never tried this before. I wanted to see how it would work, and I think that's uh, where I'll leave it for today. And thanks for watching, and see you later. Bye-bye.